Okay, Tom, let me give you my, uh, you want to Skype me at this? That's my Skype address. Of course, I have to, uh, as you do my contacts. Or you can, uh, this is my Skype, however you want to do it. Okay, please give us a call. Oh, you want? Uh, oh, go ahead and answer. There we go. Hello. Let me Tom. Just get the volume down. <laughs> hey, Tom. Can you hear me okay? I can hear you great. How are you doing, Tom? I'm doing fine. Can you hear me okay on that? I, we can hear you clear as a bell. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> hey, first off, I want to thank you for uh, giving us such a hand with the show. It's okay. We are learning our way around all this sort of thing, and we have Wirecast running on a Mac Mini. Wow. Right? Um, it might be a little bit underpowered for that. I don't know. Um, mm -hmm. But so far, so good. What we're... My, my wife is basically running Wirecast in the background, okay? Right. And so... Right. Uh, sh we read the uh, the PDF you get with Wirecast, and we've been searching for good quality information on how to truly use Wirecast, and mm -hmm. that we're running into problems with. Um, so we gotta gotta get uh, with other people and pick their brains on how to actually do and accomplish some of the things we want to do with Wirecast. Okay. Right. Um, so the first thing, if, if I could, uh, right. you use Wirecast yourself, do you not? I do, yeah. Okay. More, uh, more in a um, testing environment than a show environment. So. In a testing environment, okay. Yeah. Are you running it on a uh, on a Mac as well? No, it's on a PC. My version. Your P your version's on a PC. Yeah. I would think that at least functionality same. wise, it would be pretty much the same. Yeah, I guess. Okay. So what my wife wants to do, what I want to do, is we want to be able to have video Skype calls in Wirecast, all right? Okay. The way I understand it is yeah. that I, uh, for example, I have another Mac in front of me, a 24-inch iMac, mm -hmm. that I could uh, take the call uh, on, um, now this is what I'm trying to get my mind around, okay, if I have Skype open on this, uh, how would we, we use the desktop preventer? We'd have to have that loaded on the 24 inch iMac. Well, is the problem is the problem is, uh, okay. is you need the audio, is the problem, not the video. Okay, exactly. Aye. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what you could, you could use um, is just possibly a, a normal audio cable. Okay. Uh, I don't know what you call them. Uh, you know the phono jacks at each end. You know for the small, for the Mac Mini and so forth. Yeah. And go from line out to line in. Okay. See how that works. Yeah. Take the uh, audio out of the 24-inch uh, iMac and and use that as an audio in yes. on the on the Mac yeah. Mini. And vice versa for the uh, maybe the microphone. I okay. guess because okay. the caller you need to be able to speak to the caller. Right. Um. You see what I'm saying? So, obviously, a mixer would be a better solution. But at the moment, mm -hmm. you could you could do that. I see. Okay. All right. Um, within Wirecast, you would just select the audio as the line in. Mm -hmm. That's it. I don't know if the Mac Mini. What if, what if we tried? Could we run this to presenter on the Mac Mini and have one mm -hmm. video session? With, in addition to running Wirecast, or can you I, not I should do be that? fine. No, you can do that. You can run a desktop presenter on the same machine. Okay. Um, initially, at least on the PC, when you first run it and add the shot, it's actually not there. It's kind of strange. It, you just get a blank shot, and you've got to edit the shot uh -huh. with the asset manager. Right. And in my case, I had to put the IP address in of the machine or the name, whichever. Right. But it might work well on the Mac. We don't know. I see. Okay. But so then you would just capture. You'd use um, now. You need to get. Let me see. You need. You need Soundflower. I would suggest. We're using that right now because oh, the audience can hear you. 
that's fine then, that's good. No, well, you said then. Right. The video is irrelevant because the video is just a desktop presenter. Choose, um, let me just run desktop presenter. Uh, it's not obvious on desktop presenter first, but if you drop down the source and you see there's a, a selection called window, mm -hmm. and then the next drop down from that allows you to choose the application, in which case we pick Skype. Mm -hmm. You see? That's mm -hmm. it. Um, and that would capture the video. Simple as that. Okay, so desktop presenter. Mm -hmm. uh, source window. Source window. 